Where will the electricity come from to power a world full of Cybertrucks and other Tesla EVs? as well as all those from Hyundai Kia, the many Chinese manufacturers, or all those promised by VW, Ford, and many other manufacturers. Can we all switch to battery electric cars and still get the electricity we would need to power them? Can they all be powered by clean and sustainable renewable energy? Or are we dependent on electricity generated by dirty coal, oil, gas, for the foreseeable future. Is it possible that we could get rid of coal, oil and gas altogether for local transport? Could we also avoid the need to go nuclear? Thankfully, I don't have to do the number crunching to work it out. Many different teams of researchers at many top universities and research institutes have done detailed studies, and now a team of researchers based at Stanford University have analysed these studies and put them all together to create a detailed plan for our energy future. Their detailed plans are based on current technologies, not wishful thinking about what might be invented in the future. Their conclusions are that not only can we generate all our energy needs from renewable wind, solar and water power, but it actually costs less than generating power from coal, oil, gas and nuclear, and creates more jobs than fossil fuels. Pollution from fossil fuels kills and injures huge numbers of people and adds huge costs to our health services. Generating our energy needs from renewable wind, solar and water also results in a much healthier population. Luckily for us, the economics of sustainable renewable energy strongly support a rapid move away from fossil fuels. But we must prevent the fossil fuel industry claiming subsidies, that is our taxpayers' money, to keep themselves going, or to clean up the mess they will leave behind. So important message number one. Our pure electric cars don't need fossil fuels, biofuels, or nuclear power. And important message number two. It is up to every one of us to use social media to spread that message and the ballot box to elect our representatives who will push ahead with creating a future free of fossil fuels. And we might just save our planet as well. In the next videos, we will examine the details of how we achieve this switch to a fully sustainable, renewable energy economy. Do subscribe in order to get updates on the next videos.